so much of your pain is coming because you are asking people to give you something that they simply do not have, they do not possess. And then in the absence of their possession, you're making a ton of meaning about your identity. Okay? Hear me so you can get you can get deep deep relief. Emotional energy is like a currency, just like everybody seems to understand money. So if you come to me and you say, "Hey Julia, I really need you to give me $100." And let's say I actually want to give you $100. I think the reason you need the $100 is valid. But I literally do not possess $100. I cannot give you what I do not have. I really believe, I'm a neuropsychologist, and I really believe that neurotype, understanding neurotype is going to save the world. Hear me out. Your brain is an absolutely glorious, astounding, spectacular machine but it is still a machine. And so it has parameters, it has limits. Now, the fact that there is, for example, genetic variability, biological variability, environmental variability, necessarily then means that everyone is not running around with the same three pound globby machine in their, in their head. And so because our brain thinks that something is available to us, we draw certain conclusions, we have more empathy to give, we have more patience, we would do it different. We then therefore think that that person should do it for us. Okay, not to get crude, but one of my um, PhD mentors would always say, shit in one hand and wish in the other and see which one fills up first. Should is, is, a colossal waste of time. So when you start to really understand that people aren't giving it to you, not because they're trying to be cruel, but because they simply don't have it to give. It creates this aperture. It creates this sense of like other possibility. I can start to really think differently about them and more importantly about my own identity. If these kind of conversations feel useful to you, I invite you to join me in NeuroEnergy 365. It's going to be an extraordinary journey into the power of self-dominion across 2026. Link in the comments.